Guys, I have unlocked yet again another fifth tier upgrade on the Spike Factory, the Super Mines. Guys, this upgrade is $130,000 alone, so it's going to be quite hard to actually get this up in the game, but I think we can do it, alright? So without further ado, let's hop right in today's video. Alright boys, we're going against Niz, okay, on this wonderful map. So dude, I'm so excited because, dude, Spike Factory is perfect for this map, alright? So... Hopefully, we can actually make this work out all right. So, what I'm probably going to actually do, too, is clear this obstacle here, all right? I know. Just, just bear with me, all right? And then I'm probably going to have to go for the Dartling Gunner after that. This guy's not ecoing. No shot he's going to be farming. Oh, my. Okay, but I'm going to end up going for the Dartling as my first pop and power tower. Okay, so let's just get that. I know the Spike Factory normally is there, but... I feel like this will be one of the better spots, right? Because, yes, I am using the Dartling, by the way, uh, which is definitely a switch up, right? But I just didn't want to use Boomer once again, all right? Because I've been using that quite a bit recently. So why not switch things up a little bit, you know? So there we go with that. And I think what I'm probably going to end up doing is upgrading Middle Path, all right? So, yeah, because the Hydro Rocket Pods upgrade, from what I've seen so far, is pretty freaking good, all right? So 100% going to be doing that, alright? And round 3 is about to be here, by the way, alright? So let's start to send the young man blues now. He's going to be sending me some space blues. Okay, interesting. And also, he went for another ninja already. Oh my god, he's got two ninjas. That's actually freaking crazy, alright? But I think we should, in fact, be able to handle all these blues, if I'm not mistaken, with just a 0 2 0 dartling, alright? So that is freaking awesome for sure. And um, I don't know, maybe some of the balloons will sneak through here and there. But for the most part, I think we're going to be fine. If not, I could upgrade um top path as well or i could go for another dartling either or would work or actually let's go for striker yeah let's do that all right so i'm gonna go for striker i guess right there perfect he can help me clean up the balloons that do happen to get past my dartling and we should be all chilling all right i might though need to go for another dartling in order to defend against space whites here on round five if our opponent happens to send us those okay so we're definitely gonna have to watch out for that as of right now we do have enough money in order to upgrade to another dartling so I think we're absolutely chilling, okay? But the main objective for today's video, of course, is to showcase the Super Mines upgrade on the Spike Factory, okay? So, in order to do that, we're going to have to go late game. No if are about about that, alright? So, that means we're not going to be, like, rushing this guy during the mid-game rounds or anything like that because we want to go late game, alright? And late game is definitely possible on a map like this as long as this guy is also not so aggressive towards us during the mid and, like, early late game rounds, if that makes sense, okay? So... I think we're going to be fine, although he is, like, still passively equaling for whatever reason with blues. I really don't know why, alright? I might want to consider going for another Dartling here soon because he might be aggressive, though, here on round 7 with some yellows, okay? And definitely our current defenses would not be able to defend, so, yeah. I'm going to have another Dartling, I guess, on standby. Maybe I can go for another Dartling, like, on the other side? Uh, nah. I'm going to go for one just right above this one, okay? So... Let's just get that on the map now. Okay, awesome, awesome, awesome. And now, see, with this strategy, I start space decoying with space whites on round seven, just so I know for a fact that I can easily afford this Hydra Rocket Pods upgrade, all right? Because, dude, it's $5,000. That's really expensive, okay? So, it's definitely worth $5,000, all right? Because it is super duper effective. So, we're definitely going to be doing that. And then eventually, for a mob popping power, we're going to have a spike battery on the map. And uh, because, yeah, the Dartlings aren't that good against my class balloons. I'm not going to lie, okay? But I've been liking the Dartling because it's just like a switch. Although, like, I still love the Boomer and I want to use it more. And as of right now, I think the Boomer is the better option for my strategy because I just have more upgrades unlocked, of course. But, guys, with this new XP system, it's crazy, man. I'm getting so much XP. So, I'm absolutely loving this new update. And I was reading your guys' comments as well. I think for the most part, a lot of you are liking the update as well, which is awesome. And by the way, people were clowning me in the last video because of the perma spike, because like I, I got it up really, really late and I forgot to upgrade to the top path. Or actually, I forgot to upgrade um, to the middle path on the village to allow my perma spike to pop lead balloons. And I almost died of those DDTs. Yeah, that was almost a really, really bad um, L right there, right? But. We ended up getting it up, all right? I definitely want to try it out again because I didn't even know, guys, that you could target your spike battery to smart. Like, what? That is news to me. Like, I feel like such a bot, bro. I'm so sorry. Please bear with me, guys. I, I promise. In a year from now, I, I hope that I am not, like, this unknowledgeable, all right? Because, like, literally, I feel like a total freaking noob, okay? But anyway, it's round 13 here, okay? Um, he's still sending us blues. I'm going to be doing the same thing because he could quite possibly rush us. Maybe we could start ecoing actually with some greens. We'll do that, all right? Because I feel like he might rush us actually um, with some strength balloons here. Group ceramics 
are able to be sent on round 16, all right? But now he's going to start ecoing with yellows. Okay, so, you know, that puts me at ease a little bit more. So I'm going to start ecoing at him with some yellows too. Uh, but he still only has ninjas. He's spamming the ninjas. I think he's just going for a ton of ninja XP, if I'm not mistaken. Not entirely sure, okay? But... Yeah, we don't necessarily need the village yet, okay? Because, of course, our darlings have camo detection without the village. So, that's super, super nice for sure. Uh, but it's not round 16, okay? He's currently not equine, but I have more than enough. More than enough. Okay, I'm just going to go for that. Um, I think we shred this. Yes, we do. And, dude, it's so nice. I can easily control this dart lane, all right? But I decided to upgrade top path. Uh, just, why not? Why not? You know, that's exactly why I just did that. So, uh... I think we're chilling absolutely awesome, dude. Okay, good thing that we weren't max ecoing with pinks, or else we probably wouldn't have had enough money in order to upgrade uh, to this top path, right? I guess I just decided to upgrade to the top path just because I already had a middle path upgraded. Oh, wait, I don't have the focus fire firing either, all right? So there we go for that. Awesome. And I don't know how we're actually going to do or hold up against map class balloons with these two dart lanes. I don't think it's going to be too well, though, so... I definitely, definitely, definitely want to get a village here, okay? So, what I'm going to end up doing then, maybe I should go for the village. I don't know. Where should, where should I go for it? Maybe, like, right here, okay? So, striker or biker, I'm sorry, might not be affected, but whatever, right? I mainly just want to upgrade to the 002 because this is going to decrease the cost it takes to upgrade to our uh, third tier upgrades or up to our third tier upgrades. Look at that, dude. I have that um, placement animation because of the mastery because now I have every single upgrade unlocked for the spike battery. So that is so awesome. Oh yeah, here comes this mob. All right. So I think, ooh, 245? 245 might be an issue. 245 might be an issue. Um, hmm. We're going to see. We're going to see, boys. I probably should stop ecoing though, for sure. Yeah, definitely. So let me just go for the spike balls. Awesome. Okay, he's going to balloon boost that. I'm going to balloon boost or tower boost. And I think with that, we should be fine. Please be fine. Yes. Okay, we are. Whoo! That was scary, guys. That was really, really scary. But we ended up defending. I'm going to remove this obstacle, by the way, right? Because it's low-key kind of getting in the way a little bit. But, dude, I know he's going for a quick and easy win, boys. He That's exactly what he wants. That is why he's only utilizing his ninjas right now. Because he just wants to build up a ton of XP for that tower, all right? But... We're just not going to let that happen. We're, we're just not going to let that happen, okay? So, going for the Monkey Town, this will increase all Balloon Sends. Um, well, they'll give us 10% more Eco for all Balloon Sends. So, that will be super duper nice for sure. So, once we have, like, about $5,000 saved up, we're going to go for that. Uh, he was fine against that AI Moab. Well, well done. Currently, he is not eco -way. Never mind. He's back with the Eco, okay? So, good to see. Uh, but, guys, we might have to sell, like, literally all of our defenses in order to go for the Super Mines, man. Because this is going to be insanely freaking hard. But I, I really do think we can do it, all right? Especially if we get up this Monkey Town upgrade here. Okay, so let's just finally go for that, all right? Because instead of getting $2.4 per set of pink cent, now we get 2.6. I know it's not that big of an increase, all right? But it definitely adds up. And then if we upgrade once again to the Monkey City, it's going to increase it by another 10%. So... We're definitely going to try to do that once we can, all right? And we're absolutely chilling against all these AI balloons, all right? The only round that we need to watch out for, I think, is round 26, because that's the first round that this young man could send us DDT balloons, all right? But with a spike mines, I think we should be fine, for sure. Yeah, we definitely, definitely should be fine. Maybe I'll get a few spike storms as well, just to be ultra safe, because I know spike storms around 26 are pretty OP as well, all right? But it looks like we're actually about to be able to afford... Uh, going for this monkey city right so let's just go for that awesome 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 Three thousand eco for round 24 not too shabby all right i think we could do a little bit better but this guy honestly has been really aggressive towards us all right so i'm honestly not too upset all right but the thing is guys i want to win this game as well however i'm probably not going to be sending him a round 30 bad because guys i'm going to be spending thirty thousand dollars if i do that so i, I kind of want to put that thirty thousand dollars towards going for the super mines, right? Because I might not even be able to get the super mines until after round 30, which is crazy, man, okay? So we'll, we'll see what we can do though, all right? I might shoot for hopefully like we can hit like 6,000 Eagle. I don't know, man. It depends. It all just really, really depends, okay? But honestly, I've defended against multiple fortified BADs with this strategy before, or actually more specifically the spike factory, all right? So I, I think we can defend, all right? But currently he's not ecoing. He might send us a ZOMG here, guys, maybe. We're going to wait to see what happens, all right? So I'm actually going to go for the jungle drums as well, uh, just because that increases the attack speed, range on all nearby towers, all those good and fun things, okay? So 
yeah, we'll be a little bit more prepared, I guess. So right, and right now he's not doing anything, man. He's not like I'm not gonna send him DDTs. I'm not sending him anything, bro. Screw that. So I'm gonna end up going for these spike mines, and oh my god, look at that. The super mines is 130,000. Oh my god, it looks so sick though. I can't wait until we can get it. But <laughs> like, when are you gonna ever be able to utilize that? Like, I don't know, dude, because. It's just always gonna be insanely hard to get up unless they like nerf the price a little bit. I don't know. Well, for $130,000, it better be doing work for us, okay? I'll tell y'all that right freaking now, okay? But, oh, dude, we're actually disintegrating Moabs uh, with these Dartlings, all right? So that is awesome to see, okay? But he's got the Sniper, too. Finally, utilizing another tower. Well freaking done. Like, he was only upgrading to the Ninjas, guys. Like, that was actually crazy, all right? But, oh my god, we don't even have 5,000 Eco still, though. Okay, that's not too good. That is not too good, ladies and gentlemen. All right, we need $130,000. So what I might do is eco until like the end of round 28. Stop with my eco and literally save up every dollar to go for the super mines, all right? Because then once we got that, we hopefully should be chilling. I don't know, guys. Right now we have $39,000, all right? So not too shabby. We might be able to afford this, all right? Because we can also probably sell this Darlene and also that Darlene. That's going to give us an extra $10,000. We could sell the village as well. Oh my, so we might even throw our game in just to go for this upgrade, but like, I, I want to win too, that's the thing. He's definitely going to be sending us a BAD. He has to be sending us a BAD. All right, so we're going to stop equaling here, guys. So that means I'm going to end up selling this. I'm going to go for this um, other village, by the way, okay? So, oh, it looks like it's really hard to set down. It really is, okay? So I'm going to go middle path, uh, just a 220 for now, okay? Because I don't want to spend too much money, all right? Oh my god, guys, we might not be able to afford this. <laughs> We might not be able to afford this, ladies and gentlemen. These super mines is just too freaking expensive, but maybe he won't send us around 30 BAD? I don't know. He's got to be sending me one, right? He definitely has to be. Okay, so what we could try to do, too, is try defending against, like, the first set of BADs that's going to be sending us, and then after that, going for the super mines. Okay, so I guess we got a few options, okay? Uh, but I'm going to end up just going for some 0, zero spike factories then just to have on standby. Okay, we, we have, we have $95,000. Ninety-five thousand dollars, guys. We might be able to afford this then. Maybe. I don't know. What do we do? What do we do, guys? Oh my God, this is so scary, bro. This is so unbelievably scary. Okay. Yep. Here comes that. All right. So, yeah, I'm gonna end up upgrading to some spy factories. Oh, are we good, by the way? All right, we're good. We're good. We're good. Okay. Uh, I got really nervous right there. Okay. So, I just need more of these. I'm trying to utilize hotkeys more, by the way, guys. Okay. So. Oh, God. He's going to be balloon boosting that. That is not freaking good. That is not freaking good. Okay, so what I'm going to end up doing then... Oh, should we go for a homeland defense? Okay, we could. We could here in a second. So I might do that, and we're just going to have to hope and pray that we can defend. Straight up. That That's all we... Dude, it's going to be too close to the end of the map, I think. I think it's going to be too close to the end of the map. I, I got to try it, though. I've got to try it, all right? So I'm going to end up using a tower boost here in a second wait we could probably upgrade to maybe one more spike battery yeah one more spike storm here in a second so let's go for that awesome i'm gonna end up tower boosting using the ability and then using all the spike storms can that defend can that defend can that defend oh god it's gonna be really really close it's gonna be super duper close please be able to defend please be able to defend oh that's gonna defend right that's gotta defend right it did it defended let's go <laughs> Let's freaking go, boys. Okay, that is awesome. Oh, I was not that confident. I won't even lie. Wait, he's got to be able to defend, though. That's the thing. He has to be able to defend. Okay, no, no, no. Don't die, please. Uh, so I'm going to start selling off these spike factories, low key, so I can go for the super mines. We got $54,000. Okay, so this is $50,000 alone. Oh, dude, I kind of want to keep this homeland defense, though. I really do, man. Like, that's OP, bro. <laughs> dude, we're going to get this, though. Trust, we're definitely gonna get this. That did so well, though. That was crazy, man. This fits your uh, village here, dude. I mean, oh yeah, this is probably the first time I used this in the video. I used this like during my stream, though. Oh my god, it's nuts. It's like nuts, boys. Okay, but okay, we can get seven thousand dollars out of all these spike factories. Okay, meaning we have like four more, so we get twenty-eight thousand dollars out of that. All right, so we still don't technically have enough money just yet, but we're super freaking close. Okay, so. I'm definitely, dude, we're going to be able to go for it. No chance we're not going to be able to. And, like, he's defending against the AI balloons, are right? I mean, at first, it kind of did look bad. By the way, we could have used Biker Jones ability, too. We didn't even utilize that. Dude, we got to remember these things, man. Oh, my God. All right, but I think what I'm going to end up doing is selling these. I'm going to keep one Spike Storm, okay? 
And I'm gonna go for the super mines, guys. Oh my god, no way. I can't click on it. Oh no, this is bad. Wait, the, the wait, 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 wait. Okay. <laughs> Clicking on the wrong one. I'm such a botter, right? But there we go with the super mine, ladies and gentlemen. You can't even see it, all right? You literally just okay. It's fine though. And by the way, it's SSJ Spike Factory because that means it's a Super Saiyan Spike Factory, right? That's the nickname for the Spike Factory, okay? But we got the super mines. No shot he wins this right i kind of want him to rush us once again and i want to see how well the super mines does all right because i'm not gonna rush him okay i'm not rushing him until he rushes us ladies and gentlemen so i guess what we can do maybe is just go for a carpet of spikes as well because i mean we got enough money for it almost so might as well do that too <laughs> dude this is crazy man oh my god i know you guys don't have like a really good image of it so i do apologize i could sell this first nah 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 I mean, you guys, you guys know what this looks like, right? <laughs> it's just the, the village is so big, bro. It's like blocking out what it actually looks like. Okay, so that's kind of unfortunate. But let's go for the um, carpet of spikes. Awesome. Two fits here spike factories. No shot. Okay, so maybe for a video, I can go for all three fit tiers, all right? Um, we can't really do that now, I don't think, just because I know going for a perma spike, you just want to go for that as early as possible, you know? So, yeah. But anyway... I'm going to go for more spike storms, if anything, I guess, because the super mine should be able to handle all ceramic balloons. I, at least I hope. Um, not entirely sure, okay, but this is actually going pretty late as well, dude. Like, I am, I am actually really shocked that he's not rushing us. Like, why, why is he not rushing us? <laughs> I don't know. I honestly could not tell y'all. Um, but he's still shredding all right. So, well, well done. Maybe on round 40, like, because this is going to go to sudden death. Because we both have the same amount of lives, all right? So... I don't know, guys, all right, but maybe he's just scared to rush me, too. I mean, the second I rush him, he might counter. He's got a counter, right? He's got so many snipers. Oh, my God. <laughs> he's got so many snipers, boys. Okay, so we're going to go ultra late game with this guy. Why not? I mean, we've got literally absolutely nothing to lose, okay? And we've got goaded defenses, all right? When I say goaded, I mean absolutely goaded, all right? So, honestly, I think we're going to win this. I, I truly, truly do. It's just... When is the young man going to rush us? There's only around 40 ZOMG too, which we both should be able to handle. Um, so, yeah, I'm just waiting for the BADs, man. He's not even equin either, by the way. Oh, actually, of course, yeah, because he's getting all the money from his snipers, okay? So that makes sense. What's his third and final tower too, by the way? He has yet to uh, reveal that, so that's quite interesting, all right? But it's now round 38. We've got a lot of spike storms, man. <laughs> This is so awesome, bro. This is like literally the first time that I've went this late, I think, as well, dude. Like, I have not went this late ever. So, this is quite exciting for sure. And I'm just going to be spamming the heck out of these spike factories. We got 7,500 eco. Oh, my God. I don't think we have any more room in the back of the map, really. So, oh, wait. We can fit one more spike factory right there. Perfect. Though, all right so yeah i don't want to go for any more spike mines because like the super mines should be able to handle all of that at least i think you know so by the way we could sell this very quickly just so i can show you guys yeah i'm gonna do that so that's what the super mines actually looks like by the way okay because <laughs> we couldn't see it the entire time all right i know i wasted money by doing that but i, I just really wanted to show you guys what it truly truly looked like all right so there we go. Back for the homeland defense. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Oh, he's got super. Dude, he's struggling out here. Oh, my God. That pushed quite a bit. Oh, my goodness. But I don't know if Super Monkey is going to be stronger than the Spike Batteries, man. Spike Batteries are insanely, insanely stronger, right? Maybe against the AI balloons, though. We're going to struggle here. Oh, my God. It's already laggy, too. <laughs> it's already a little bit laggy, so... Man, eventually we might just have to say screw it and just rush him, all right? Because I do still want the win, boys, all right? So with this many spike storms, what do we have? I can't even tell. Oh, the images are too big. I think that says 14. I think we have 14 um, spike storms, all right? So that, that's pretty solid for sure. I mean, we're handling the AI balloons quite well as well. We still do have these Dartlings on the screen too. They're probably not doing very much at all, but it's fine, okay? We'll keep them there. And of course, too, we have this carpet of spikes, man, like... <laughs> This is just crazy, man. Okay, so maybe like on round 40, we'll send him a single fortified BAD. And uh, we'll just see how he reacts, all right? Because I don't think he's going to be able to defend. I uh, Actually, no shot he's going to be able to defend. So he's going to have to counter me. He's going to have to, bro. He just has to, man. So I, I, I just want to put these defenses to the test, you know? I, I truly, truly do. So 
hopefully he'll end up countering me or else we don't really get to test the defenses but that just means he knows like how good the defenses are because i mean look at look at this entire map dude just filled with spikes because of the carpet of spikes can't even see the super mines but i'm sure it's going in we still do oh let's see how we can oh my god oh <laughs> look at his side guys he's barely popped the zomg Oh my god. We're just gonna send him a single one, by the way, boys. Single BAD. Let's see how he reacts, right? Please counter. You've got to counter, bro. You literally have got to counter. I don't think, even with the Super Monkey, he's not gonna defend. He's not going to defend, guys. Oh my god. Look at that flying. Look at all the DDTs. <laughs> no shot, boys. He just sent us so many DDTs on round 40. Rampy starts on round 25, so that means those DDTs are insanely strong, and we just disintegrated them. Please counter. You're not defending. Counter again. Counter again with more DDTs. <laughs> this is crazy, boys. I'm just gonna spam all my abilities. Oh my god, look at this lag. <laughs> this is crazy, man, all right? I think we are going to, in fact, end up getting the win the spike battery man is it the best tower in the game let me know down in the comments i honestly think it has a great chance of being one of the best if not the best man because i mean did you just watch that what <laughs> did you just watch that bro holy crap please if you did enjoy today's video don't forget to drop a like and also if you are new to the channel make sure to click that subscribe button all right we're trying to hit 300 000 subscribers by the end of the year this strategy, by the way, is absolutely not so right. So I hope you guys did, in fact, enjoy. Once again, that is all I have for you guys in today's video. It's been your Wobble Tricks or Justin. Peace out, everybody.